Hey guys, so I dug a little bit deeper with this Crest Trade Pack storage because I was kind of interesting and uh, intrigued by the fact that it's a thousand credits, and I was kind of wondering why. So after a little bit of research, we found on Reddit that this is actually the top tier best in slot storage container chest, meaning it's the lightest weight. As you can see, it's 600 kg right there. The weight factor actually having a low amount of weight will make your boat go faster. So every storage chest pack is going to have a base weight. The base weight is actually 900. So we'll pull up the folio right here. This is the very basic one that you can craft. Or it actually has a thousand. So this is the very basic one. Uh, I'm not sure exactly if this one comes on the ship. So we'll check that out in just a second. And so you can see it's a thousand kg. You cannot put an image on these to my understanding. If you can, please let me know. And to make the one that you can buy in the cash shop, it's right here. This is the last tier, the top tier storage pack. It's 600 kg and you can see all the materials that it actually takes. You have to craft all the way up. So just just looking at these materials, you have to craft 36 Nui Forest Lumber, which is a ton. You have to craft 18 Sudden Ridge Ignits, which is a ton. 24 Star Shard Ignits, 36 Crystal Stabilizers, 12 Dragon Essence Stabilizers, and then a rare Typhoon Trade Pack storage design that you find out in the wild, in sunken treasure ships for mobs, and such forth. Craziness. So that is a that's so expensive right here. Um, so with that understood, it makes this price a little bit more reasonable, I guess. I guess? I mean, honestly, we don't realize how much this weight difference is going to have an effect. We'll go take a look at a boat right now and show you what it comes with basically right now. But you can also add custom images to this to each side of the chest, which that's pretty cool. Uh, I definitely like that aspect. Let's take a look at a boat. All right, so we've spawned our stock merchant trade ship. So it looks probably familiar to most people, or maybe a little different if you've never seen a merchant trade ship, but it carries 20 packs. Click on over here, and this is the component stat menu. So it shows you the health, siege damage decrease, weight, ramming power, collision dam defense, move speed, turn speed, buoyancy limit. Buoyancy is how many people can actually be on the boat before it sinks. And then this is the customization when you're here. You can see you can take off the trade packs. And when you do that, you'll notice that the little boxes on your boat are magically disappearing. This is pretty cool. This, you know, this is fun. This is cool and different. And you can totally customize and take off, you know, all the trade packs, a few trade packs if you're going solo. And the benefit of that is that you take your weight down, which means your max speed is actually going to be a little bit faster. So we'll go ahead and show you what we're talking about with speed-wise. So it's pretty bare right now. We have no tree packs. We have just two cannons on. And we're able to get to going about... Looks like we're going around, around 12 meters per second we'll go ahead and throw all those chests back on and you can see they magically pop up on the screen there it's pretty cool effects and we pop them all back on and our speed has dramatically decreased because of all that added weight. So we were normally going 12 meters per second. And now with 20 packs in here, we're now only going 10 meters per second. So a huge, huge difference right there in speed. The one pack that you can actually buy off the marketplace is the top tier best in slot weight wise, 600 kg. The ones that you start off with are the thousand ones. So these are the very first tier. You're given these for free on your merchant ship. 
You can also remove your cannons and put trade pack storage containers in the cannon location. So if you just want to go balls to the wall with no defense whatsoever, you can load up your ship with 22 trade packs by taking off your cannons. And you see, we can't customize because we're not near the port. We have to actually be near one of the main ports. We have to be around this big aurora here in the Arcadian Sea. Or we have to be down in Solace over here. Or we have to be down over, and I believe it is two crowns. I believe it's right here, so it doesn't show because we haven't been over there yet. But yeah, you can actually take off your cannons to reduce your weight, to go faster, or to add more storage packs on here. So you can see weight plays a big factor. Again, just taking all those guys off, we lost 2 meters per second on our, our, you know, our speed. That's dramatic. So they are actually selling best-in-slot storage containers. Um, I personally don't think they were, are worth a 1,000 credits, but when you look at it that way and how much crafting materials are needed, it will definitely save you a ton of gold, and you get to customize them with images as well. So that's a cool factor. Uh, but hey, I thought Trine World said they were never going to sell best-in-slot items, and these are best-in-slot items on the cash shop. Wow. Hmm. Imagine that. Another Trine World lie.